Hi, hello, it's yours truly. <laughs> um, so I'm sure you guys are like, okay, where are your videos? Like, where are you? What are you doing? I, I don't know why I put so much like weird pressure on myself to have like a YouTube upload schedule. I don't think anyone that I watch on YouTube has a YouTube schedule. I really don't like, cause I was sitting here thinking, I was like, what is the best option? Like every other day or three times a week? Like what is like really good for your channel? So then I wanted to kind of, you know, get some ideas. So I started going to like several people I'm subscribed to and I'm like, none of these people have schedules. What am I doing? Like the only one is H3 podcast. And that's different because it's a podcast. But like nobody, like m let me go to my subscriber list. You guys can hear some of the people I'm subscribed to. Life plus Cindy, Sarah Ray Vlogis, Tyler Feller. I also follow Sarah Ray Vargas, which is um, like her main channel, which she's now doesn't upload to her vlog channel anymore. She does her vlogs on her um, main channel now. Alexandra Rodriguez, Rem Life, Christina Randall, Pink's Vlogs. Darius, Pink Sparkles, Tammy Lemon, Kendall Ray, Ryan Hall, Alicia Marie Vlogs, Nicole, of course, Levita Demeg. Like, does she even upload anymore? I don't think so. Um, just so many random people, and none of them have schedules. And I'm like, why am I putting so much like thought and time and like process, like into like trying to find a schedule when I, I don't need one like so I'm just gonna upload whenever and I think the lack of pressure is gonna make it to where I want to film more I notice that when I'm not so pressured to film it makes me want to film more the psychology of the brain is is a weird one let me tell you hello Amazon haul <laughs> so I have this sweater next to the bed and it's literally right next to my nightstand. Rarity sleeps on it every single night. She literally just follows me everywhere. Where I am, she is. So when I'm sleeping at night, she likes to sleep right next to me. So she sleeps on that sweater. And I was like, mama wants to put away the sweater. So instead of moving where she likes to sleep, I decided to get her this really cute, it's a soft reversible pet blanket. I am going to take the sweater and put this blanket there. Someone asked why do I have garden shears in the kitchen? These aren't garden shears, they're just like kitchen scissors that come with my knife set. <laughs> that was so funny when someone said that, I was like what? Cute little bow on there. Oh yeah, she's gonna love this because she likes that soft feeling. So this side is gray and like velvety. And then this side, it's like that nice soft material. So we're gonna lay that out for her and she's gonna be comfy. And then I also have one last thing here. So I've been back on my Animal Crossing game. I am an Animal Crossing fanatic. Um, I will have to show you guys my island. I got a case for my Switch. <laughs> Tell me this isn't the cutest thing. Like I've had a case on my Switch for probably four years and I'm like, I think it's time we get a new one. So look how adorable, oh my gosh. I thought this was so cute. It's pink, but it also has a little scream moment and then this is for the controllers so this is what rarity sleeps on every single night so now i'm about to take this and put this down there is like little paw prints in here i don't know if you guys can see those let's see isn't that so cute so i actually don't know if she would want to lay on it like this or if i like turn it over i think i'm gonna leave it like that so this is my switch this is the case that i've had on it I don't like I've had it for so long I don't even know where the case for the actual controller part has gone like <laughs> where are you I don't know so I'm gonna take off these little guys here for now and I'm going to slide this in oh my god come on baby girl I'm an idiot let's just put it on like a jacket oh my gosh look how adorable uh, 
Now it's time for the actual handheld moment. My gosh, look how cute. I don't know what it is, but this like just makes me so happy. Oh my gosh, look how adorable. Okay. And then this one has like the little phone on it. See? <laughs> yeah, this is definitely worth it. This was not even that expensive either. So now the blue one is covered. And then we just slide the back on. Bam. Look how cute. And then the back of it. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I'm going to have to show you guys my Animal Crossing Island. If you guys want to see that, definitely let me know. Hi. Hello. Hello. Hi. Is that how I do all of my segments now? Hi. Hello. Hello. Hi. Okay. So, we're in my closet. Now we are really in my closet. So spring is almost over and I don't think I've done like any spring cleaning. Maybe like 20%. So I want to start like spring cleaning or summer cleaning really I just am like really wanting to just purge stuff so I want to start with my clothing um, I'm not gonna do it all today we're gonna do it in segments I just feel like there's a lot of clothing I want to get rid of that I don't wear don't want to wear etc etc like there's no point in keeping it if I don't want it you know what I'm saying so I figured I would take you guys on the journey so we're gonna keep this cozy sweater here. So this is a velvet shirt that I have not yet even worn, but I don't want it. <laughs> so I'm gonna get rid of it. And I'm gonna start my get rid of pile right there on the floor. So I have no rhyme or reason what I am pulling. I just am pulling something random, looking at it and deciding if I want it. So here is a Ew David shirt, which I'm gonna be keeping because I like to sleep in it another random definitely keeping this sweater black with hearts it's super cozy and cute so this is a shirt it's beautiful but I don't like the sequins because my hair hooks on it whether it be my hair is down or it's the baby hairs or I'm holding Twinkie or something or like the cats their nails just like a regular degular animal claws do not like this type of material either so gonna get rid of her so this is like a sweater dress that I am going to be keeping because I do enjoy wearing it when it's cold out. So last one I'm going to do for now because like I said this is going to be an ongoing project. Rome wasn't built in a day. Am I right folks? So this is just a really pretty oh my god it feels so good sweater that I oh my god I don't know I'm like iffy on this one. So we're going to have a maybe pile and we'll get back to her. So update on the new season of Black Mirror. Uh, the first episode loved it third episode loved it fifth episode loved it loved it loved it loved it loved it but the second and the fourth no so i want to know what you guys think but i will say if i had to choose a favorite it's either the third episode or the fifth that's a hard one black mirror definitely took me for a, a ride this season i will say that because it was like good episode bad Good episode, bad, good episode. Hey guys, so I wanted to give another update on Feline's tattoo. She's actually going to get more done tomorrow. So if you guys remember, speak no evil, see no evil. I didn't show you guys when she got this done, but she finally got hear no evil, which this is my favorite. Look at him, looks so good. There's a band around his ears. So yeah, I think it looks so good. And she's gonna get more done tomorrow, pretty soon. All right here is gonna be covered. People were asking like, where did I write on her arm? Like, where did she put my handwriting? It is right here, actually. It says so much, so much, so much, because when we say I love you, we always say so much. It's just like something we do. I didn't actually write that on her arm. I actually wrote it on a note and then she surprised me and went and got that done. And I was shooketh. Shook. The lesbians be crazy. Lesbians be crazy, yeah. And she has a few other tattoos that has to do with me and like stuff like this pluviophile moment. But um, yeah, people were asking, so I figured I'd show you guys. Okay, you guys, so we have a massive grocery haul. So let's get into it. We got some mandarins, strawberries, apples. Royal Gala, so we'll see. 
some broccoli. I love broccoli cooked and raw. Two bags of spinach. I got some seasoned turkey patties. I love turkey burgers. So good. Some chicken. Got some carrots. Some raspberries. I truly feel like this is nature's candy. I got some mozzarella string cheese. Some bacon. Some spicy dill pickle almonds. I've never had them before, so I figured I would try them. And then just some like roasted uh, salted almonds. Got some cottage cheese. The best brand to get it is definitely Daisy. Some brown rice. This is just some maple and brown sugar uh, 100 calorie oatmeal. Some baking soda. Got some bananas. Three things of coconut water. Two things of chicken sausage. I love chicken sausage. I got these in roasted garlic. I got some more brown rice. But I got some frozen brown rice. Got some asparagus. Some cauliflower. Some eggs. Some frozen strawberry peaches and bananas. Some frozen berry medley. And this is a frozen fruit and greens. Okay, you guys, so I just ordered this uh, raspberry, or not raspberry, is it blue raspberry? I just burped, excuse me, oh my god. I ordered this from McDonald's, and I also got a Diet Coke. But it's like a little icy moment. I was hardcore craving it. Tomorrow, me and Feline are starting a no takeout challenge. The challenge literally consists of, don't order it. Like, there's no goal like go 10 days, go a week, go 30 days. There's none of that. It's like literally just don't order it. Um, I'll talk a little bit more about it, but I said, you know what? I'm gonna get me a freaking icy because starting tomorrow, literally we're done. I, I recommend these. They're actually very low calorie, but I mean, obviously they have like a lot of sugar and carbs, but if you're literally just strictly counting calories, this slaps, it hits when you need that icy. But anyways, I do wanna end this vloggity vlog. Sorry, my hair is so frizzy. I, I'm i having like a moment where I kinda wanna chop like half of it off. So we'll see if I end up doing that. Anyways, I hope that you guys did enjoy this video and I'll see you in my next one, bye.